Salutations, uh, top of the morning to you. It is another bright morning here in the great state of Utah. Uh, I'm Phil Willis, aka JC Servant, and I wanted to take a few minutes to follow up on a few things that have happened on the channel. As I mentioned earlier, I haven't been playing City of Heroes for a while, and uh, our guild uh, kind of fell apart. Reunion uh, has become a much slower server, and it was already a slow server to begin with. And so uh, I moved on to other things, and I made a video along those lines telling everybody about that. I didn't want to keep any of you hanging. I know I had a lot of people who were subscribing, and my assumption was that a lot of them were subscribing, uh, hoping that I was going to make more City of Hero videos. I thought for a while I was going to, but when everything slowed down and kind of died, my interest in the game waned as a result. And I'm kind of a forthcoming type of guy. If the game's no longer interesting uh, to me, uh, and I have no more interest in it, then I, then I tell everybody and I move on. So, but what was interesting was that after I had taken those steps for the following weeks, maybe it's been like a month, I, I don't remember, that a lot of you reach out and say, hey, really liked your videos. A couple of you were very flattering, uh, said, hey, I really enjoyed hearing your voice every day or on your videos. And I really appreciate that. I don't often get too many compliments on things, so I, I deeply, deeply appreciate that. And it's because of that that uh, I decided to uh, make this video. Uh, personal, uh, par partly to thank all of you. And then partly to say, hey, maybe 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 we could do something more. Um, really, my intention was, with City of Heroes winding, uh, you know, kind of winding down, I wasn't going to make videos for a while. If you look at the history of this channel, I've made videos for various reasons over the years. Uh, I enjoy theology. I've made videos on theology. I like old games. Made plenty of videos on those. Newer games. Made some videos on those. So uh, there's a plethora of different reasons I have made videos over the years. Kind of waned and waxed in and out and have enjoyed that but now that i have a number of people who've been subscribing to the channel and leaving comments uh, which uh, again thank you i never even asked for it. i'm not one of those guys who's like eh, like and subscribe and all that i honestly don't care uh, very strongly about driving channel growth or anything along those lines if things happen things happen you know that's great it's not a big deal uh, i just kind of believe in doing what i like to do and if people get enjoyment out of it, that's just awesome. If nobody gets enjoyment out of it, well, I enjoy doing it. That was the whole reason why I did it. And that's what's kind of important. So with that all said, I will uh, open up this discussion of what you guys might want to see in the future. Is there is there some kind of uh, content that you would like to see in the future? You can get an idea of kind of some of the stuff that I'm interested in doing just by looking at the history of the channel, but I do video games, namely role-playing games. Uh, some strategy games and action games here and there, though. I do enjoy games like the Dynasty Warriors games and Earth Defense Force, and those are very action-y uh, type of games. I I'm not a hardcore gamer. Uh, I don't get into the super, uh, you know, tough like Dark Souls or any of those games that really require great reflexes. Really good at Monster Hunter, though. Really do enjoy Monster Hunter. I can, uh, but I also enjoy a number of games of going all the way back to the 80s. Uh, I've got a couple of videos. I think one of my best videos, I should say one of my videos that have the most hits, was the one I did on the old Dungeon Dragons video games on the PC from back in the 80s. So plenty of those guys uh, out there. But uh, you guys can let me know. Uh, if you want to see me do more videos and what kind of videos you might be interested in. As I mentioned, I do theology. I am a, uh, a Christian. And I do enjoy answering questions about the Bible. And had a long conversation last night with a gentleman and, and answered a, a number of questions and talked him through some things. So I'm always happy to do that as well. I also handle financial, or my, my real paying job is I do finances. So if you ever have any financial questions, I can help answer those. But if there's a particular type of videos that you would like to see, let me know. If you just don't really care, you're just like, hey, 
Bill. I, I just like to see you make some content. Don't care what it is. Um, just let me know that too, as well. Shoot me off a message. If you want to talk to me directly or message me directly, uh, you can do that on Discord. I'm at JC Servant. Of course, you know, the comment section below here on YouTube works really well for that purpose as well. But yes, uh, just you can friend me on Discord. Just say, hey, got, got your name off of YouTube and I'll accept your friend request. Uh, I'm still on that server that I've mentioned earlier uh, for City of Heroes, but I'm probably going to leave that soon. I'm the kind of guy that if I'm not active on a server, I just tend to drop out of it. I don't like having 50 Discord servers sitting there. Uh, I try to only stick on the Discord servers that I'm actively gaining information from or contributing to in some way, shape, or form, and whatnot. So, yeah, please let me know. In other news, you can see what I'm playing right now. It's the City of Heroes Vista Pandaria uh, event. And I'm having a good time with that and working my way through some of the Pandarian quest. If you're not familiar with this event, it started just a few days ago. And it runs through... Is it? Well, it's got like 93 days left. It's like a three-month event. And as you do this, uh, and as you kill enemies, and you do quests, and you run dungeons, you get bronze. Bronze can be used to upgrade your gear eventually. But one of the best things bronze is used for, in my personal opinion, is uh, buying transmogs. All kinds of transmogs. And once you unlock up in mounts and pets and all that fun stuff, the collectathon that is World of Warcraft. And as you unlock those, it unlocks on your account permanently for all of your, your characters. So that is super cool to me. You can even unlock some of the most rare mounts from Mr. Pandaria. One in particular was from a world boss it literally had something like a one percent drop chance and that boss only showed up like once a week or once a day not sure but it was very very rare it was something i would never do i i, I just I, i'm not a big fan of, of very low rng uh, in hunting to get stuff or whatever have you but uh now you can buy it for fifty thousand bronze that's not a bad deal uh, bronze gets easier and easier to earn the higher level you get and there's a number of different ways to get it whether you're killing mobs or doing dungeons doing raids they open up the raids and the dungeons early so they're uh, in level so you don't have to wait very long to, to get to those uh, and and get your uh, get your bronze from that as well so very excited about the war with it. I could talk about that for, for quite a while. If, this, if War of Warcraft chat is something you guys are interested in, Diablo's also got a lot of good things going on right now with its loot 2.0. But yes, again, thank all of you who have left kind comments. I really do appreciate it, those of you who have subscribed. And if there's anything I can do to help make your day a little bit easier, a little bit more fun, a little more entertaining, let me know. Also, uh, before I leave, one of the one of the interesting comments was about my uh, voice. It was kind of soothing and stuff. The, so the funny story here is, I did those videos usually early in the morning, first thing. I've been very busy lately, and usually once uh, once I get too far into the morning, my day starts to get away from me between work and running Pathfinder Tabletop. It's another thing I talk about, by the way. I'm a longtime dungeon master. I've been dungeon mastering for decades. I'm a professional dungeon master, and I run tables usually uh, for 20 to $25 a chair via Star Play. So if you want advice on that, I've been doing it for years. I'd be happy to do videos on that. I run Pathfinder 2nd Edition, if you're wondering. It's a very crunchy, tactical system. But every fight matters, and death is a very real possibility if you're not careful. But I digress. The... So going back to the story here about the, the videos. So the funny thing is I would do these in the morning. And being somewhat of an older guy, mornings and I don't always get along. And I will just be kind of waking up. I have my cup of coffee right here. And I'm drinking coffee and I'm making these videos. And my voice is at a different pitch in the morning. 
but I'm not even fully awake yet. And I'm kind of tired and sluggish, and that all reflects in my voice. Apparently, a lot of people like that, and so I, I thought that was just kind of interesting. So I have to do these videos in the morning when I'm just kind of low energy. I thought, why would somebody want uh, the videos, uh, you know, from somebody who kind of sounds low energy? That, that almost seems unintuitive. But then I thought, maybe it's because YouTube is filled with a bunch of people. I love what, I, don't get me wrong, I, I watch a lot of YouTube, a lot of video game reviews, a lot of uh, video game news. Uh, even the occasional world news and politics talk, and of course, plenty of theology. And the world is filled with a lot of people uh, on these channels that yell and scream and scream and yell and are very high energy and, and as such. Maybe uh, people wouldn't mind hearing something that's a little bit more low key. I know I, uh, I prefer that approach myself. I'll give a shout out to uh, Riker, he does uh, a lot of videos on Diablo and action RPG content. And I always like him, he's got a great voice. And and I won't say he's quite as low energy as I am in the mornings, but he is, he's on the lower end of that spectrum. And I much rather listen to him than certain other people. I have unsubscribed from YouTube followers because they're a bit too energetic, <laughs> yelling, screaming, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and all that jazz and super full of energy so as you get older some of that stuff gets on your nerves just just a little bit at times especially if it's too early in the morning so i also don't even like the television if someone's got the tv turned on loud in the morning uh, with all that yelling and screaming and all that stuff going on you want to do the old man thing and just say shut that off or get off my lawn it's, it's just terrible. I like having a nice, quiet morning. But anyway, thank you guys uh, so much. And uh, let me know what you think. And maybe I'll be making some more content soon as a result. But until then, have a great and awesome day. Happy adventures. And may God bless you.